Hi everyone. Today's lesson is on drawing a jungle. The picture that you see in front of you is done by the artist Henri Rousseau. He was an artist a long time ago that wasn't trained to be an artist. He liked to draw, he liked to paint, and on his lunch breaks he'd go to the zoo or the botanical gardens and grow and draw the flowers and the animals that he saw at the zoo and the botanical gardens. So if you look at this picture you will notice it's one of my favorites it's called the storm. You will see things in the front, you'll things, see things in the middle, and you'll see things in the back. Things that are in the front are called foreground. Things that are in the middle are called middle ground and things in the back is called the background. So the picture that we are going to draw today will have a foreground, a middle ground, and a background. So we're going to start with a white piece of paper and you can start with a pencil or if you feel like you can start right away you can start with a black crayon. So I'm going to draw things that you would see in the front of the picture, in the foreground. So you might see tall grasses. You might see flowers. You might see a tree. Let's put some animals in it. Earlier this year, I taught you how to draw a big cat. So we start with. You don't have to draw the whole cat because he's behind the tall grasses. Maybe there's a snake on the tree. I have things in the front. So I'm going to draw a line. Now I'm going to draw things in the middle. Maybe there is some hills in the middle. Maybe there is another tree in the middle. Now I'm going to put things way far in the background. Maybe some mountains. Now I have things in the front, and in the middle, and in the back. So now I'm ready to color. I can use crayons or markers. I think I'm going to use crayons. I could change back and forth and use some markers.
now you have a picture with things in the front, foreground, things in the middle, middle ground, and things in the back, the background. Have fun!